All right. We are in the Algebra 2. Topic 2 review problems. Cruising right through. Hopefully you're doing well today. And yeah, all right. So this is a little tricky problem, it looks to me like. You got this where you're supposed to rewrite it in the uh, perfect square form. So an x plus, you got to take the 7 divided by 2 to figure out what goes in there. And a lot of times what you'll see them do in this problem is They'll move the five fourths over to the other side, which would be subtracting it. And now when you do this form of the equation, like if you do the X plus seven halves times X plus seven halves, what you find is your X times your X, your X squared, that's good, you needed that. Um, and then your seven halves X here, and your seven halves x from those two that's three and a half x and three and a half x so when you put those together that does equal your seven x that you needed here that's it always will work that way it's just the number on the end here that is being added the seven halves times seven halves remember you multiply straight across with fractions so seven times seven is 49 and two times two is four. So you've added, um, by writing it in this form, this perfect square form on the left, you've added 49 fourths that wasn't in the problem. So you got to add that 49 fourths to both sides of the equation, which 49 minus this five would be 44, right? 44 fourths. And 44 fourths, that's just 11. So when we did this, this side on the right needs to be an 11, and the left side is the 7 out. So there's our equation. In parentheses, your x plus 7 divided by 2. Arrow to the right to get out of that denominator. Close your parentheses, shift 6 for an exponent. Square it, arrow to the right, get out of that exponent. And equals 11. And that's it. So uh, hopefully you followed all of that. If not, go back and slow it down. It was again just the the uh, whatever this number is right here. You put it over two, and that's what goes there. And then you just have to after you square that add that to both sides and uh, subtract. Don't forget to subtract this C term to the other side of the equation. So good luck, more practice if, if you need it. Down at the bottom, similar question, no more help. Give you an example, help me solve this.